The moon is made of cheese, and I'm going to prove it to you. The moon is extremely photogenic. Think about it. There's no other planet or celestial body in our solar system that we take so many pictures of. We are simply infatuated with the moon. Every time we see a beautiful moon outside, we take a picture of it. And what do we always say before taking a picture of somebody? Say cheese. From this, we can prove conclusively using science, philosophy, logic, and a little bit of stupidity in between that the moon is made of cheese. Here's how. From our discussion we just had, we can make two definitive equations. Equation number one. Whenever we take a picture of the moon, it always turns out to be a good picture because the moon is extremely photogenic. This is one equation. Moon plus camera equals good picture. Whenever we take a picture of somebody, we always say cheese. That is the second equation. Camera plus cheese equals good photo. Now, since both of these equations equate to good photo, we can equate them together. So, camera plus cheese equals moon plus camera. But we have camera on both sides of the equation, so we can just cancel that out. One, two, and what's left? Cheese equals moon, or moon equals cheese. Now, obviously, I've just proven to you using science, mathematics, stupidity and logic that the moon is made of cheese. I've provided equations for you, but the scientific community was not impressed. They wanted more from me. They wanted hard evidence. And this is where my investigation came to a complete standstill. I was at a dead end because I did not know how to bring conclusive evidence to this case. And then it hit me. Which animal loves cheese more than any other? The rat. Ladies and gentlemen, I came up with a plan. If I could catch a rat looking at the moon, it could only mean that the moon is made of cheese because why else would a rat look at the moon, unless it was made of cheese? And as we all know, rats love cheese. So, I set my trap. I placed cameras all around my basement, hoping to catch a rat. For a long time, I'd never caught a rat. And then, yesterday, on the night of the full moon, something happened. As you can clearly see, a rat came out of the basement and went to look at the moon. If I had a mic, I would mic drop, but I don't have a mic. So, bam, in your face, science, 